Happy Monday everyone. We are starting out the work week with more of that hot temperatures and more of that a little bit more potential for some thunderstorms as we go through the day today. We saw some thunderstorms in the last couple of days, especially in areas of Siskiyou County and east of the Cascades, a little bit of Jackson County yesterday as well. So we will be watching for that potential once again, because of course there's always that potential, especially in July, almost August for very dry conditions, some gusty winds and the spread of fires. That's definitely something that we're trying to avoid once again today. It's very active really throughout much of the country. Things actually calm down just a little bit for our area as you go a little bit later into the week. It's going to be hot at least through today and tomorrow, but generally we are going to start to cool down, especially towards about Thursday and Friday because we have low pressure in the area. This will actually increase winds, especially on Tuesday and Wednesday, so we'll be watching that for fire spread. But as we cool down, we even start to see a little tiny, tiny little bit of potential for some showers out towards the coast and further off to the north. Most of us staying dry, staying warm, staying hot even as we go through the end of the week. But still just seeing this in the area is good news. It keeps us away from the extreme temperatures like what we saw yesterday. For example, now let's go through the day in our pinpoint forecast. A mix of a lot of things in the sky as we go throughout the day. Some fog out there towards the coast, some low clouds as well. A bit of low clouds and even some higher level clouds as we look elsewhere and also, of course, some smoke and some haze from fires in the area and that'll clear out slightly as we go into the afternoon. And you're going to see it again. These clouds building up over the higher elevations, big fluffy clouds eventually turning into thunderstorms for some areas, especially east of the Cascades. A lot of potential there and even in Jackson, Siskiyou County once again today. Let's go a little bit later into the afternoon. Some of those will pick up a bit more. This is saying in particular the basin area looking a little more active, so we will be watching for that as well. Continue through Tuesday. Start to calm things down a bit on Tuesday. You can see potential is there once again in the afternoons. We typically see in July and you add a little bit of moisture to the atmosphere, but won't see as much thunderstorm activity as we get into the day. Tuesday by Wednesday should be mostly on the calm side of things, but still pretty warm, pretty dry. Now for today, partly cloudy fog and even some haze from local fires. Temperatures in the 60s and 70s, partly cloudy later tonight and fog returns after midnight. For the West Valley is partly cloudy, but we do have that hazy conditions. We also have that potential of thunder storms mainly in Siskiyou County, but that potential still makes its way into Jackson, possibly Josephine County. Mostly cloudy tonight with some scattered storms continuing and yes, 101 degrees for Medford. You can call it a cool down from yesterday, but still pretty hot out there. Partly cloudy east of the Cascades as well with storms possible this afternoon, mainly in the 80s and 90s. For your seven day forecast today, the more active day then things generally calm down as we head towards about Thursday and Friday. Temperatures still well above average until about Friday. That's when we start to cool down and keep cooling down. For the Klamath Basin, also plenty of potential thunderstorms out there Monday and Tuesday. Not as much on Thursday. I'll take that out, but temperatures cooling as we go towards Thursday and Friday. Northern California, also potential thunderstorms today, less potential tomorrow, and even cooling down a bit. Sunny skies towards Thursday and Friday. And for the coast, great place to be, but we do have some haze from those fires in the area. Also some cloud covers, some fog in the mornings, clearing out as the day goes on. By about Friday, the slightest potential further to the north for some showers.